So hi everybody and welcome to my channel. So I had some people get in touch with me and ask me, hey, time for streaming. It's easy to go ahead and add storage to your Amazon Cube, but how do you add storage to a Fire Stick Max? So stay tuned, I'll show you how to do it. It's time for streaming. So hi everybody and welcome back to my channel. Thanks for tuning in. I really do appreciate it. Today I'm gonna to be working on the Fire Stick Max. If you're looking for a new Fire Stick, check out my description down below. I have a couple of links for different Fire Stick products. No extra cost to you. I do get a small commission and it does help out support the channel to bring you some more good videos. So today we're gonna to go ahead and add extended storage to your Fire Stick. So what you need is an OTG cable. I'll leave a link in the description also, so that way you can purchase one off of Amazon and you need a USB drive. So now what you need to do is go ahead and take your OTG cable, take the one end, plug it into your Fire Stick and the other end gets plugged into the power supply for the Fire Stick. So once you have that hooked up, you wanna go over to where the gear is. Go ahead, click on the gear, also known as settings. Go ahead down to where it says My Fire TV, click on About, and then go and click on Storage. Here you see where it says Internal Space and External Space. Let's go ahead now and plug our USB drive into the OTG cable. What should happen now is a message should pop up asking us if we want to do external storage or device settings, device storage. Go ahead and click on Device Storage. Are you sure? And say yes. Give it a few minutes to go ahead and format the USB drive that we just plugged in. Once you receive the message saying format and complete, go ahead now and click on OK. Let's go ahead and click on that back button. Click on it one more time. Let's go over to where it says applications. Let's go ahead and click on applications and move to where it says manage installed applications. So here on the applications and manage installed applications, you can see where it says internal space and then external space. So I have 7.81 gigabyte available on my USB drive. Now let's go ahead and I'll show you how when you download an app, it automatically goes to your USB drive. Let's go ahead now, let's click on the home button of our Fire Stick 4K Max. Let's go over to the left, Let's go to find, let's go down to search. Let's go ahead and let's just go to, and let's download Plex, just for an example of what happens. Let's get the Plex app. If you like what you're seeing, please click on that like and subscribe button, ring that bell, this way you know when I put up other videos. I really do appreciate it. On the apps and games, go ahead and click on Plex. Give it a second, download, you own it, go ahead, give it a click, say okay. Give it a few seconds to a download. So now let's go ahead and let's go ahead and click on open. Tip for now. Let's go ahead now and click on that home button on our remote. Let's go over to the right again, click on the gear, scroll down to applications, scroll down to manage installed applications, and here you gotta look for Plex. Right here you see Plex and it has the new USB drive, that means that that download went automatically onto your USB drive. So now you say, hey, time for streaming. What about the apps that I already have on my Fire Stick? Can they be moved? Yes, they can. Let's go ahead now and click on that home button of your Fire Stick 4K Max. Let's go over to find, down to search. And let's click in the word file. There it is, File Explorer. Go ahead and click on it. Go over to the right and click on Explore. Give that a few seconds to come on in. Say, get free to download. Let's give that a second to go ahead and download and install. Let's go ahead now and click on Open. Give it a few seconds to open up. Say Allow. So within this App Explorer, you can do a lot of different things, but today we just wanna go ahead and focus on the apps that we have already installed onto our Fire Stick. That way we could go ahead and move them to our storage that we just set up. So what you wanna do is click on internal shared storage. 
Once you have done that, go ahead, click on download, then go over to the left, click on where it says App Manager, click on App Manager, then go ahead down and click on Installed. So let's go ahead now, let's go ahead and move an app. Let's go ahead and find an app that you want to move. Press on your Enter button, hold it down, and come over here, click on Move. Say OK. Now it's going to be, where do you want to uninstall it? Go ahead and say OK again. Now over here on the right hand side, on the download, go over to where it is, go ahead and click on it. Give it a few seconds, click on Install. Give it a few seconds to install like you're doing it for the first time. Once it comes up, we're going to go ahead and click on Done. Now that it has come up, go ahead, click on Done. Now what you want to do is go ahead one more time and long press on the app that we just moved. And let's go ahead and say Delete. We don't need it. It's the APK and we already installed the APK onto our Fire Stick onto the USB drive. Go ahead and say OK. Now go ahead, click on that home button on your remote. Let's go ahead, let's go over to the gear or settings. Go ahead down to where it says applications. Go ahead and click on applications. Go down to where it says manage installed applications. Go ahead and give it a click. And let's go down to the app that we just moved. Here it is, it has a new USB drive right to the right of it. I hope you find this video very helpful. Please leave your comments down below. Let me know what you think about this way of moving apps onto a USB drive. And remember, day or night, it's time for streaming.